winter has come. Let's see how this small block of ice stands up to our small flames. Remember that we're trying to develop an intuition for what real dragon fire might look like. Will it look and behave the same way that TV producers think it should? I've got this oxy map gas torch again. This produces a tiny white hot pencil point of flame when adjusted correctly. Will it instantly blast through the ice? Will it turn water into vapor with explosive results? Will it crack and shatter? What's going on here? It takes a lot of heat to turn water from a solid to a liquid. It takes 80 calories of energy to melt one gram of ice. A calorie is defined as the amount of energy it takes to heat one gram of water by one degree. So the transition from frozen to thawed requires 80 times that much heat. And that difference, that extra heat to thaw something, is called the latent heat of fusion. If we want to turn water from 100 degree hot water into a water vapor, it requires 533 calories per gram. That's the latent heat of vaporization. As you can see here, it's just turning the ice into a liquid and flowing away. Look at how awesome it is to basically drill through the ice with this brazing torch. I made another video with a big block of salt. Think about whether that will look more like a dragon destroying a wall of ice. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, subscribe, and leave comments. And don't try this at home. Come on over to my house.